Big win for the Stanford Cardinal, thanks in large part to Katie Bear. 20 big kills. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. I'm excited to be here. So, Katie, after such an odd year last year to come back and to be able to play as a team and to put an effort like this against a squad like Florida, what does it mean to the group? Oh, it's amazing. Last year was a tough year for us, but like to be able to bounce back and actually play some six on six in practice, it's really prepared us for big moments like this. Well, Katie, I see you as somebody who, when you get isolated out there one-on-one -on -one, or you get a little opening in the block, you can be really scary. But I think that as you progress, do you think that you're going to get better and better when you have to go with the high ball against a, a big block that knows you're getting the ball? Oh, yeah. We've been grinding that for a while now. Since freshman year, we've been working on that high ball and just really not, uh, nailing it in, dialing it in, and just going for it. I know my team has my back on that, so I'm just going to go for it. Well, that's a good good attitude to have. You moved it around pretty well. Um, you know, I found you, you showed me you got a lot of shots to work with out there. Thank you. I appreciate it. Katie, a big opportunity for you this season, joining a team that had so many veterans. We've been saying there are some unknowns on this Cardinal team. This is a chance for you to get out there and, and, and play a lot. What's it like to have this opportunity to really be able to show what you can do against the Pac-12 and against the rest of the country? It's amazing. Coming in freshman year with like Catherine Plummer, Morgan Hentz, they really pushed us to be better. And so having that experience has really helped me grow as an athlete. And now I'm just ready to go build our own legacy, carry what they taught us, but build our own legacy as a team now. How do you feel that, uh, you know, I know the coaching staff for the most part is, is fairly new. I know Kevin's been around for now for a few years, but, you know, bringing in Courtney and, and uh, Gary's been, you know, not been with you all that long. Um, you feel like the coaching staff and the team is, is working really well together in matches. You know, you, you haven't had very many matches like this, but I know that the communication is so important. How do you feel that's been going? Oh, yeah, that's one of our big values here, communication and collaboration. We work with them, they work with us, and we got a good balance going. And we absolutely love our staff. We have the best time in practice. We get after it. The energy is amazing. Courtney is awesome. Great addition. Gary, we're learning a lot from the staff, and it's amazing. What's it like just to be back playing? Uh, I was talking with Coach Hamley this week, and, and just a simple road trip to Philadelphia was, he said, so much fun because it was some sense of normalcy. What is it like just to be back as a team? Oh, it's unreal right now. We are just living in it and having the best time of our lives, just going after it, getting after it in practice, and just enjoying the games that we get to play. If we get to play, we're going to go for it. We're not going to take it easy. And I know it's just one win and it's the early season, but how does a victory like tonight serve as a confidence booster going forward into what is a very difficult schedule? Oh, yeah. He's preparing us for these tough schedules down the road. But having a victory like this, it really prepares us and it shows us that we can pay. We can play with the big guys and we're ready to battle. No one, no one should doubt us right now. We've got a good go going. Good stuff. Katie Baird, congrats on the win and thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thanks, Katie.